Okay, the next step is how do I get my child's vocabulary or adult, the individual I'm working with's vocabulary, onto the PC that's running the PASS software that you've just downloaded, or New Voice, whatever you want to call it. So, of course, you're going to have to have a jump drive, one of these little guys that everybody has. You're going to go up to your child or adult's device, individual's device, and you're going to slide that in there. And once you put that on the side of the device, you'll put it in, the, the, uh, and I'm using my PC just to make it easy, but you look on the side of your device, you'll see there's a spot to put your USB drive in there. Then you're going to click this button, right here with the one tools, and you're going to go into the toolbox. And now you're going to go right down here where it says transfer memory. And when you do that, what you're trying to do is save one user area. You could save the entire device, but for now, just save one user area. So if you wanted to save the individual you work with the entire device, you'd do it here. If you want to save one user area, you'd do it here. Now remember, you're on their device, the, the one they're using. So you'd say save, and then you'd go to the area they're using, and you'd say, I want to save that area. And then you'd tell it, you know, that on there it goes right to that jump drive. But now you'd go in there and you'd spell it something like John, well, if I could spell, test or something. Something usually, some, some, some way knowing it, what date it is or something. And it takes it a few minutes to download. And now, that, now you have a file on a jump drive that is a backup of your, the individual you work with file. You know I'm going to say child every time, so just let me quit worrying about it. All right, so now you take the jump drive out of the, your child's device and uh, you take it over to your PC where you've downloaded PASS, which we learned in the video before. And on the side of the device, you're going to stick this little jump drive in. Now you're going to go to the, the, that's on your computer. You just you went to your computer and you slid it, so the jump drive in. Now you go here on the PASS software that you've loaded. You go to the toolbox. You get transfer memory. You're not saving one user area. Now you're loading one user area because you're loading it. And then you tell it which area you want to put it. And then you'd find your file that you've named. Here's mine, John Test, right here. And when I touch that then, it takes it from that jump drive and puts it onto my PASS software. Wow. And now I've got a copy of my child or the individuals I work with's device. So that's what I've just done. So that's the step two, how to get your child or individuals you're working with this device's vocabulary backed up onto a jump drive put on the PASS software. The third step is going to be how to make screenshots once you've done that.